New energy vehicles require so many lithium batteries. Have you ever worried that they might be unsafe? Let's take a look. A BMS that provides safety protection for lithium batteries, especially for this type of BMS, they can withstand high current levels of vehicle regulations. How is the internal protection mechanism implemented? At the beginning of this video, let's first get to know an electronic component, relay. Relay is a great invention and creation in the history of human technology. The many times of relays, its working principle is to input different variables, inductive signals such as current, voltage, temperature, pressure, etc. When these variables reach the set values, output control signals that achieve on and off of the controller circuit. When the input volume decreases to a certain extent and remains long enough, restore to the initial stage again. For example, temperature relays automatically perform power on and power off actions when the external temperature is both or below the set value. For example, electromagnetic relays utilize the suction generated by the current in this input circuit between the iron core and the armature of the electromagnet to achieve the on and off action of the circuit. The relay functions as an automatic regulator in the circuit safety protection, conversion circuit, and other functions. It's actually an automatic switch that uses small current to control the operation of a large current. Most common lithium battery BMS use integrated the circuit MOS transistors for protection by using MOS transistors for switching circuits. However, due to the limited withstand voltage and the overcurrent values of MOS transistors, for high voltage fuels such as electric vehicles and large energy storage base stations, or in some areas that require high current discharging or charging, the BMS of integrated circuit and MOS transistor scheme is prone to limitations. The BMS of the relay scheme can effectively cope with high voltage and high current scenarios. On the BMS of the relay scheme, the adopted relay is a multi-contact relay that integrates multiple functions at one point, depending on the different forms of input variables. Simultaneously convert, disconnect, and connect multiple circuits, realize automatic remote control and monitoring program control circuits, thus achieving automatic operation. The most prominent advantage of the BMS of the relay scheme is that capable of withstanding large currents and voltages. You can customize settings as needed, for example, adjusting parameters such as protection voltage and current during the discharge process. It also has advantages such as high reliability and strong anti-interference ability. But due to its large size, high cost and high weight, the BMS of the MOS transistor scheme can be smaller more flexible and more durable. Therefore, in low speed or low current fuels, the mainstream choice is still the BMS for most transistor solutions. This is the end. Likes and subs appreciated. See you next time. Bye.